Hey Ranger Nation, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be looking at Jack Beastbot um, from the Beast Morphers toy line, um, or we just know him as Jacks from the TV show. Now, I've got to admit, I kind of really like this figure. It looks really cool. Um, I know he's not going to have any sort of articulations. I'm kind of a little bit gutted. Um, and yeah, I'm just wondering what the sound is going to be like. So let's have a look. We've got this lovely window display. We've got Jacks in the background. And we've got two carrots, which I don't think we've actually ever seen him have on top of his like being used in the series. So I'm guessing that they they added this just for uh, extra stuff because of what you're going to get. So you have the morph X key. You have the lovely um, oh was it the the spinning blade thing that goes on top of his head. Uh, and then you've got the kind of carrots on the back. It shows you what's there um, and shows you how to attach the key. I think that they should have attached it to his head type thing because that would be kind of cool. Um, but also one thing that I've noticed is because you've got all these ones, uh, you've got here, you've got um, Zoe in the background. Uh, so that's kind of cool. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much the back. There's not really much to the top and there's not much to the bottom. So let's open up this bad boy and have a look inside. Here is Jax, and rather doing multiple angles is kind of no point to it. Um, let's have a look. So first of all, you've got his eyes. I really like these, this is kind of cool. You've got the silver, many yellow, all of it pretty much yellow, silver here. He's got these wheels, which is kind of cool. So you can move him about a little bit, maybe. Um, I would have laughed if it was like a wind up toy. That would have been absolutely awesome. He has kind of ears moved down like that. So there on the back, there's this hole. And I didn't realize what this part was for, but that just literally goes in the, in the back, adds pretty much nothing. Maybe if you know what it is, let me know down below. I know it looks like the rabbit thing from the Zord, but for that to happen, oh, it's his kind of normal backpack thing. Oh, uh, there we go. Answered my own question. Um, so you could have him kind of, it, look, it just reminds me of like R2-D2. You've got red here on the ears. You've got his eyes. You've got the silver there. Um, do these go all the way around? Yes, they do. If they didn't, I'd be very surprised. So we've also got his head. So I generally thought that this one on. So let's move his head down. So you attach that there. That's kind of cool. Just... spinning blade you could put his ears back up if you wanted to but then it wouldn't spin and then let's just add the kind of next part which is the carrots this is gonna be like the shortest review oh wow do they actually go in so why is it a certain like is it hexades a hexades oh, it's a hex type thing okay so maybe there's certain ones you know, for such a small, there you go, it works. And I was gonna say, it's kind of weird. And like even pushing it in just like that, it's kind of ruining it. We're gonna leave it like that. So that's pretty much Jack's there. <laughs> Why? I, I, I know that they needed to add something extra, but dear God, that just looks a bit weird. Um, I think I'm gonna take his carrots off. Um, I just keep reminding me of R2-D2. There's really not much. I'm going to do this all in one. So let's move Jack's there. Let's get the morpher. So let's see what it says when you put the key in. So, sorry, Jack's. So. Hey, don't call me cute. Don't forget your carrots. Yellow ranger and red Pretty much, that's all you can get. Um, let's look at the key. I really like the fact that it's orange. That's kind of awesome. And then, and then when you look here, you've got the kind of eyes up there. That's kind of awesome. Um, a little bit of detail, but not much. Um, yeah, it's just you know, move the key that way. I'm not going to attach it to Jax. There's no point. Uh, it just looks really angry. Like, damn, damn, it's going to attack. Um, but yeah, I do like the keys. They do look really cool, but kind of really wish you got more with Jax on this one. There we go, Ranger Nation. There is Jax. To be fair, it's not really much of a long review. There's not really much you can do with this one. There is slight detail on his chest, which I kind of missed out. But yeah, um, for the price that I paid for him, 
I think that he's probably worth a little bit less, mainly for what the figure is. I'm kind of glad that they did bring him out because I think that um, you know, you'd need him for the entire whole series. So it's nice that they've not they've oh, it's nice that they've added him and not just kind of left him out. But I do think that his price should have been a little bit lower. So Ranger Nation, what are your thoughts on Jax? Do you think that this is worth the the money? Do you think it's worth picking him up, or do you think that it's not worth it let me know down below in those comments and if you've enjoyed this video then hit the like button hit the subscribe button as well as that cheeky notification bell to be notified when more videos drop and as always ranger nation thank you very much for watching and i'll see you in the next video